morning, good morning, man. It's another blessed day. Welcome back to another video, Certified Gang. Now look, I could have woke up this morning, I could have chose violence, I could have chose to sleep in, but what did I choose? I chose to wake up and make a video and drink some Gatorade on ice. Listen, y'all can call me bougie, but the Gatorade on ice just hit different, bro. I got a little fruit punch right here. Hit. Now, certified gang, on a more serious note, let's talk about something before we get into the video, man. Setbacks. I know a lot of you guys as football players, man, we work out, we're trying to get better and everything like that. And sometimes when you take one step forward, it always feels like something happens to take you five steps back. And I'm not gonna lie, bro, I just recently experienced that, you know what I'm saying? Don't worry, it don't got nothing to do with me playing on this Juco team. I still am in class, I'm still on this team and everything like that. But your boy kind of re-aggravated this small little injury he's been dealing with for the past couple weeks or so. Now what I'm dealing with ain't nothing serious. It's not nothing that's career ending or it's gonna keep me out for a long time. But it's just annoying, you feel me? You know, I'm out here trying to get better and then I re-aggravate it and then I'm back in the spot that I was already in. I'm not gonna lie, when it happened, I was very negative about it and I, you know, I was down in the dumps. But hey, you know what I'm saying? Things happen. This don't stop me from getting better. I can still move, do my thing and anything like that. But we're just gonna take it slow for about a week and then we're gonna be good. But if any of you guys are watching right now, bro, and you experience a setback, man, don't get down in the dumps. Don't get negative, man. Always positive thoughts. Keep on working and you'll be fine, bro. With that being said, you already see the title to this video, man. We are back with the rating. My subscribers, Game Day Football Helmets, dog. Now we done the drip. Would you guys love that still? And we done the helmets, man. And you guys seem to really like when I rated your guys' helmets. So we just gonna bring it back for part three, I think. Basically, if this is your first time watching, basically how it works is all of my subscribers that follow me over on IG, man, they send me a little DM of their little helmet. You feel me? I get them all together and then we rate them one through ten. So with that being said, let's just get straight into the video, man. Leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new, follow me on IG, and let's do it, dog. First certified game member of the day is right here, me. Look like he got that shut F7 drone, very basic white color with the black face mask, and then he's got the battle iridescent mouthpiece, man. Listen, battle. I don't know if any of you guys or any of you executives that are watching, man, work with your boy. You feed me, anyways, man. Shut F7 is a real good looking helmet, but I feel like I got so used to it looking at it that. Like, it still look good, but I'm just so used to it, you feel me? So with that being said, uh, it got a nice little look like, I don't know if they got a visor on that drone. Actually, it don't got a, well, it do got a visor, actually. If I had to rate this on a scale of one to 10, I'ma give this one a solid 7.5 out of 10. Next up, we got a Speed Flex. Speed Flex gang, where you at, man? And he got a shock visor on that drone, look like the clear one. Um, well, no, it looked like the clear mirror one, actually. Um, black face mask is basically the first helmet we just saw, but just in the Redell Speed Flex um, shock visor. That's, that's the zero G right there. Black little uh, chin strap. It's a basic helmet as well. I'm gonna have to give this one a 7.5 as well. I like the little background on the picture. You took this outside in the grass, none to mine. Let's move on. Next up, we got this Redell Speed right here. And um, at my new college that I'm going to, I'm pretty sure that's the helmet I'm gonna be rocking. I saw a lot of the uh, old teammates wearing that. But anyway, this drone is blacked out. It looked like he just painted over everything, even the Riddell logo, um, black face mask. He's got an Oakley visor on there with a yellow little, you know, uh, Oakley sign. Then he's got a yellow mouthpiece, which looks beautiful. beautiful. Reminds me of the uh, Corvette, Corvette Steelers. <laughs> Anyways, uh, if I had to rate your helmet on a scale 1 to 10, it's all black jumps pretty hard. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to give this one an 8.5 out of 10. Next up, we got a burgundy, burgundy, burgundy. Red L Speed Flex, man. I really, really like this color right here, man. And you could tell this dude was a linebacker or a lineman because he was head knocking. Y'all linemen, I don't know what it is y'all do, but y'all always got y'all helmets messed up. Y'all ain't got to clean like a DB like me. You uh, me. The visor on this jaw is pretty cool. I like the colors. On it, um, kind of adds a little bit of different to the burgundy face mask and burgundy reduce to be flex. He even got a burgundy chin strap. You just play for the burgundy, burgundy Niners? <laughs> Anyways, if I had to rate your helmet on a scale of 10, I'm gonna give you a, uh, give this one an 8.5. Slide in another Riddell Speed Flex, and this kind of reminds me of like a little 49ers or a Trojans colorway, everything like that, but he got a gold face mask, which is five. Looks like it was painted over though, because it got little scrapes on it, battle mouthpiece on the job. Oh, hold up, hold up. Hold on, I ain't even notice what he trying to do right here. You see them little rings? He got that little state championship rings in that joint. Hey, I never was a state champion in high school, so congrats to you, bro. Look like you was 
three times or something like that. Uh, but the helmet, I like that. I like the little gold stripe down the middle, but it looked like the gold is a different color than the gold on your face mask. Got a nice little clear visor on that dome. If I had to rate your uh, helmet on scale one to 10, I'm gonna get this one a, I'm gonna get this one an 8.5 as well. And the rings, they get a 10, man, congrats. Next up, we got this helmet right here. Yeah! This helmet is fine. I don't know how I was about to cuss, but I'm not gonna cuss. This helmet right here is fine. I love the like, what is this, chrome green? And the yellow, you feel me? And this is just a high quality picture, you feel me, bro? I can see your eyes, your pupils, all of that, bro. Whoever, wherever y'all play for, y'all almost look like y'all play for a college with that quality of uh, pictures. But I'm not even a big fan of green, but I really like this helmet right here, Speed Flex. He look like he probably play, yeah, he number 60, play a lineman. Um, if I had a Rachel helmet, bro, this one's gonna get a 10 for me. Next up, we got LM right here, man. Yellow and a blue with a gray face mask or Dell Speed Flex, man. Uh, white chin strap. Can't tell what type of visor that is, but he does have a visor on there, John. Yellow and blue reminds me of, uh, in Indiana, the school called Carmel High School. Um, I'm not too much of a fan of it, but I got a Rachel helmet. I'm still one of 10. I'm gonna get this one a 7.5. Next up, we got a shut that helmet right here, man. In black and black, black face mask, black helmet right here. This reminds me of, like, them original helmets, dog. Like, I'm talking about back in 2008, the original helmets that hurt your head, didn't have no good padding, none of that. That's what this look like right here. But he's got himself like a little chrome um, face mask on that, on that face mask visor. And you can see him in the background, he's putting up the piece. I was like, nah, you know what I'm talking about? He got a pink uh, chin strap, which is cool. If I had to rate this helmet, I'm gonna give this one a six out of 10. It's just not my favorite design of helmet, but a helmet is a helmet at the end of the day. You still knock your head. Next up, a purple Riddell Speed Flex with a white face mask. Man, I like this colorway a lot. You don't really see a lot of purple and white. Um, I like the, the shade of this purple right here, and then I like how you got a white chin strap to kind of set off that purple as well, man. I'm telling you, it's just how you set it off. You hear me? Set it off when the little boost of battery, you already know who that is, huh? Uh, if I had to rate your helmet on scale one to 10, I'm gonna give this one a, a eight. Eight out of 10. Next up, okay. I like this right here, man. I like the little American flag visor. And I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. Like, I like, you know, visor designs and everything like that. But sometimes it gets a little too much. But this one ain't too bad, you feel me? I like the Riddell Speed Flex uh, red face mask right here. He got a red chin strap. It looks like he got a battle mouthpiece as well. Um, as y'all know, I'm trying out the next trend mouthpieces, which I like those as well, too. Um, but a white uh, helmet, look like he got like a little charger lightning bolt <laughs> symbol on his jaw, and then he got some on the top. Very basic kind of colorway, but I kind of like how he put it together. So I'm gonna give this one an 8.5 out of 10. Next up, we got a white and blue school right here, and he got a blue face mask, Oakley visor. I mean, Oakley visor, but I meant to say blue. He do got a blue face mask, but I meant to say blue visor as well. You feel me? A uh, white helmet, look like it says LR on the side of his thing, or R or something like that. Um, it's a very, very basic colorway, but the way that blue kind of hits that, that blue face mask and that blue visor, that kind of set it off. So we're going to give it a, I'm going to give it some 7.5 out of 10. Oh, we got the stock shut F7. When I mean stock shut F7, this is how it is when it come out of the box. Like no changes, no nothing. Just a white shut F7 with the uh, gray little face mask on it. Look like the face mask is an alignment face mask too. He got a black chin strap. But this is a very, very basic helmet. I'm not saying it's ugly or nothing like that because it's not an ugly helmet, but it's just basic for me. It don't really do nothing for me. So I'm gonna give this one a five out of 10, bro. Uh-oh, we got a green gridiron right here. BB green gridiron. Y'all another company, if y'all watch it, bro. That's what your boy and on to my uh, black matte shut F. Oh, I messed up. Black matte Riddell Speed Flex. Um, it looked like he got a shock visor on that John. Look like it's some type of mirror. I can't tell if it's chrome or clear. Uh, he got a gold mouthpiece right there. And that, them blackout helmets, bro, it's just like, I don't know, all black just looks so nice to me, you feel me, rather than like all white or something. So if I had to rate this helmet, I'm gonna give this one an 8.5 out of 10. Next up, we kinda got like a little side profile. I'm pretty sure this is a Shet F7 too. And this John is all yellow. All yellow, you know what I'm saying, man? They just like that. I wish you would've just took the picture from him, you know, so I could see the full helmet, but from what I see, it looked pretty nice, you know, look like got an Under Armour vibes on the dome. Um, white tint strap. You got a white tint strap, which is cool, but it kinda, I don't know, it just don't really go with what you got going on. It'd be cool if you had yellow too, um, or blue, because it looked like your school's yellow or blue. But if I had a Rachel helmet, 
I'm gonna give this one a 7.5 out of 10. Uh oh, we got a tiger paw right there. You know what I gotta do? I gotta. Tiger paw in the yellow and blue with a Riddell Speed blue face mask, Nike visor, man. I like the blue face mask. The yellow in your uh, like type of shading, I like the color of yellow right there, you know? And I like how you put the yellow chin strap to match up with the yellow. Come on, bro. I, I see what you're doing, bro. If I had to get your position, from the looks of you, probably put a running back or something. I don't know. If I had to rate your uh, helmet on scale on the 10, I'm gonna get this one a, this one a 8.5. I like this. Ooh, I like this helmet right here, bro. It's a very, very basic helmet. Don't get it twisted. But I like that color, of, like chrome orange you got on your helmet, bro. And I like how your chin strap got the little orange in it as well. Like I said, bro, you guys can have very, very basic helmets, but it's just little things that you do with the helmet that, that just makes it fire. Ah! You know what I'm talking about? So if I had to rate this helmet on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to get this one a, uh, I don't know, bro. I, I think I'm going to get this one a 9, bro. I just like it, bro. I don't know. Ooh, this right here, bro. This is a semi-pro helmet right here, man. San Diego Silverbacks right here. You know what I'm saying? Um, I like their color combination. Reminds me a little bit of Ohio State. I like the red face mask, the Redesby flex. I like the visor he got on that John right there. And then I like the black and red stripes got going down the helmet, the little San Diego Silverback. Oh! Monkey on the side of that John was more like a gorilla. You feel me? Anyways, bro, this is a fire combination. This silver is nice. If I had to rate this helmet on a scale 1 to 10, I'm going to give this one a 9.5 out of 10, bro. I like this a lot. Ew! This helmet right here is nasty. I've never seen a helmet this color, bro. I don't think I've ever seen a helmet this color, bro. It says grind on the side of it, which is all right. I, I don't know, bro. Like, some stuff is just corny to me. Like, certain words and stuff is corny to me now. Back then, it used to be better, but other than that, the grind I don't really like, but the color of the helmet I really like. It's like this light little bubbly purple, you know what I'm talking about, with a red stripe down, down the middle. Um, other than that word grind, you feel me? This is a helmet that's five, so for that, I'm gonna have to get this one a, uh, I'm gonna get this one a 9.5 as well, bro. Ooh! I think Buddy right here playing on the same team as the other dude, because this is the same, uh, like, color scheme. This is the same color scheme as the other guy's helmet. Um, uh, just difference in this. This one got a shock visor on that John. And that's pretty much it. So if I, I had to get this one to 10 to, we're just gonna move past this one quick since it's the same helmet. Next up, it looks like this one's yellow. It pretty much yellow. I don't know what type of, you got them little LED lights in your room and you know, you changed the color to blue, but I can't really tell. It looks like yellow, uh, black face mask. You feel me? Black and yellow, black and yellow. Blue mouthpiece, that's what it look like. Uh, but this, this helmet is fire, bro. I, I like that black face mask. And I like the color of the helmet. So I'm gonna have to rate this one a nine out of 10. Last but not least of the day, we got a Redale Speed right here, and this looks like a silver and a white and, like, black. I kind of like that logo on the side. It looks like a big R. You feel me? He got a star on his helmet, big R on his star on his helmet. That means he making plays out there. White face mask, and it looks like the visor he got on that John is beautiful, beautiful. Got some green, some purple, some pinks in that John. Um, Redale Speed, like I said, bro, is just such a classic helmet, bro. You can never go wrong, even to this day, man, so... If I had to rate this, I'm gonna scale on this 10. We're gonna hit this one with an 8.5, dog. With that being said, this wraps up rating my subscribers game day football helmets part three. Let me know if we should do a part four. Let me know if we should rate anything else. You feel me? I like including you guys in videos like this so we can connect a little bit, get to know each other a little bit. You feel me? With that being said, leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel if you're new. Keep on striving. We ain't gonna let no setback stop us, man. Each and every one of y'all, and we out, dog.